Hello, and today we're looking at singing and living peace. Now, the psalm that we're reading today is a, a bit of a funny one, really, because I half think it belongs in Proverbs. It gives a list of um, things that you can do to serve God well and some reflections on what might happen if you do or you don't serve God well. And one of my favourite bits of this psalm inspired our craft today. It says, the Lord makes firm the steps of one who delights in him. I really like that verse. So that verse inspired me to plan this week's craft. Beth, would you like to read? Step one. Right, so step one, colour in your character on the singing and living peace page design your design their boots okay so i've already colored my character in and i've copied his superhero costume from last week and now i'm going to design his boots now obviously i'm trying to keep my design of of hearts and pink and orange going just to keep richard happy really but um <laughs> you can choose what you want to do with your design and obviously this is the design that you're coming up with as the one that would be in your book but like with other weeks if you'd like more than one pair of boots for your superhero you can use the card boots in your craft pack as a template and you could make your superhero two three even four pairs of different boots if you'd like okay so nearly colored these in and that is step one we want to step two Done. then yes copy your design onto your boots and use them and use the tabs to put the boots on your superhero you can you can add logos if you want okay now i knew my second logo was somewhere now we did the logos a couple of weeks ago and i saved the little circle ones because i thought i might put them on my boots What's really important when you're designing your boots is you make sure that their little tabs are facing each other because if they were both that way round, you'd give yourself two left boots. Okay, so I'm just going to copy my design and you can choose to copy your design or come up with a new design or, as I say, make yourself two or three or four pairs of boots if you want for your superhero. Here we go. So... This is my first bit of my design. Then I'll just now you could colour in the tabs or you could just leave them white. I'm going to leave them white because it's quicker, but it's completely up to you. If you wanted to colour in the tabs, that would be fine. There we go. Colour in this one. And colour in this one. I guess the other thing you could also do with your boots is draw a design on the back and then they could be double-sided. I didn't even think of that till now. Right, so I've got two logos which I'm going to put with my super me because I'm super when I let God into my life. So I put those onto my boots. And now I'm going to put my boots onto my superhero. So I just need to fold the tabs and the tabs will keep the superhero's boots firmly in place. So here's one. And here's the second one. Okay. So here you go. There's my superhero with his superhero boots. And these boots help stop our superhero from slipping and help him to make the right decisions. And we'll finally get on to step three. So this is one for you to do at home. Draw a cartoon strip about your superhero boots or write some questions to your superhero about their boots. It would be really great to see a picture of your superhero or to see your superhero cartoon strip or questions and see what you've learned from making a superhero um, with a manual this spring.